If someone wants to go to the park to kick a ball about, you say, maybe tomorrow I'm too tired and my back hurts. And maybe that's true, but how does that make you feel inside? You see the look of disappointment on his face. You promise you'll make it up to him next time. Dad, Dad, come in the garden, let's play catch. Oh, son, I really have to get this report finished, you say, knowing deep down that work has nothing to do with it. It's simply the effort needed to get out your chair. You slept like hammered shit last night. You stuffed your face full of junk food and coffee all day long, and now you're home and two beers deep. The third and fourth beer seems much more appealing than chucking a ball about. Besides, it's hot outside this evening. Another excuse, and deep inside it burns. Your son retreats, deflated. He says to himself, I wish my dad would play with me like all my friends' dads do at school. Dad's out there, let me ask you a question. Do you want to get to the end of your life and the dinner table be full of people at Christmas time? And when I mean full, I mean your sons and daughters showing up because they want to be there with their families too. Do you want them to fly across the country or halfway around the world to see their old man because you were the type of dad they loved, looked up to, admired and emulated. Of course you fucking do. So stop eating for two, get a grip of your priorities in life and put your son first for a second. For some of you, this might sting. Good, hope you're doing something with it. There is no greater investment than your own flesh and blood.